this is the bow and arrow exercise. So working on scap stabilization and strength. Um, in this exercise, we're using basically it's unilateral. So we're working on just his right side in this case. Um, so he's working on range of motion as well as strength for that scap and thoracic spine. So have them lying first uh, on their side, uh, the affected side on top. Stack the shoulders, hips, knees, feet, the side is nice and straight. So we're going to use a TheraBand. Probably um, one that's nice and long enough, probably about arm's length would be good. So you're going to start first with arms extended. The key to this is making sure that your neck and your eyes, again, follow your elbow this time. So he's going to work on a row, essentially. So he's here. Make sure that shoulders relax and down. No head, shoulder hiking, so no upper trap recruitment. But squeeze through the shoulder blades in here. Bend the elbow, keeping it close to your body. Out. And his eyes and his head follow his elbow. That's one way to start it, to make it just a little bit harder. He's going to come up, and his elbow's going to kind of go up towards the air. So we want to come up this way as he comes back. So same idea, but now the elbow comes up and back. So now we're working on that thoracic spine motion as well as that scap strength there. Eyes are following the hand the whole way. The hips aren't necessarily rotating, but through the thoracic spine in there. So we'll go through this for one set of 10, maybe two sets of 10 if they can tolerate it. We can do both sides. If we're more worried about the right side, just worry it up unilaterally just here on the right. Those are called bow and arrows.